Welcome to the Royal Calcutta Turf Club Calcutta Races Summer Meeting 6th day Tuesday 2nd April 2024 Race Preview The first race of the afternoon is the Amber Dew Handicap for horses rated 1 to 26 to be ridden by the jockeys of Indian nationality to be run over a distance of 1600 meters The first runner we are looking at is Septimus Severus This is from race number 139 After racing mostly in southern India this was the first start for Septimus Severus in Calcutta track where it took the turn in 5th spot Eventually stayed on in fifth. This was over 1400 meters, and the winner here was Oremelo. Septimus Severus again ridden by R.S. Bhatti. Number two is Yawar, Moonlight Magic out of Yemen Desert. Four starts for Yawar after coming down from Western India. Best start was in race number 107, where finished on second to Born to be Spoiled, who was subsequently placed third. The start we are looking at is from race number 149 where Yawar was in a forward position as they entered the home street then started to back paddle and eventually finished on 7th. Number 4 is Sun God. Sun God after switching stable this time was the first start for Sun God over 2000 meters and it was a decent start for Sun God who was uh, in 3rd spot for the most while then came up with a run and eventually finished on 2nd in the money. The winner here was Cristaldo who made every poster winning one. We move on to the second race of the year afternoon, the Robin Hood Handicap for horses rated 21 to 46, rated 1 to 26 eligible to be run over a distance of about 1200 meters. Couple of runners we are looking at this is from race number 140, Bundle of Charm who took the turn in 6th spot, eventually dropped back and finished on 7th and number 8 that is uh, Kindred Spirit, Kindred Spirit took the turn in 8th spot, made up a few placings and eventually finished on 5th. Earlier start, Kindred Spinners finished on second in race number 133 behind a Blinky Bill. Number two is Dubai Prince. Dubai Prince has had a couple of starts in the season without being placed in any of them. This start was from race number 133 where it went to 1400 meters, was in 12th spot, made up a couple of placings as you can see in the top screen on the wide outside. Eventually finished on 10th of 14 runners. The winner here was Blinky Bill, who won that race by four and a half lengths. Number three is East Side. East Side has uh, placed earlier part of the season. Last three stars has been unplaced. Race number 131 finished on 7th over 1100 meters. In race number 145 finished on 9th over 1200 meters. Last start went over 1600 meters for the first time, raced in 4th spot for most while then eventually finished on 6th. 4 runners, this is from race number 151, we had Rizina who took the turn in a forward position then started to drop back, eventually finished on 9th. We had Devuska who took the turn a little wide, eventually came out and finished on 8th after being in 10th uh, spot for most while we had Mr. Perfect who was in 11th spot made up a few placings and eventually finished on 6th as you can see towards the inside in the white cap and we had number 12 which was Sparkle and Shine who came up with a late bit and eventually just missed the frame finished on 5th. Number 9 is Extravagant Star. Extravagant Star has had 4 stars. The best start was perhaps the first start it had in the season in the 2000 guineas where it finished on 4th. Since then, three unplaced efforts including this one where it raced in 5th spot for most while and eventually finished on 5th. The winner here was Dubai Station who got that race by almost length and 3 quarters. Number 10, Chili Lady who's our race mostly in southern India. This was the first start Chili Lady had on the Calcutta track. Race number 18 went over 1400 meters, was on a start to finish mission as you can see in the light grey jacket. Then I've eventually ran out of steam and finished on 5th of 15 runners. The winner here was King's Retreat who got that race by 5.5 lengths. Number 11 is Primo Victoria. Primo Victoria has been knocking on the doors, has been going over various distances, finished on third in 1100 meter race finished on second in a 1200 meter race last start in race number 149 went on a start to finish mission eventually finished on fourth the winner here was hoping sky
Last runner is number 13, Thalame. Thalame has had four starts in the season. Best start was in race number 68, where it was a little slowly out of the gaze, then eventually finished turn third. Last start again was slowly out of the gaze, took the turn in sixth spot, then now weakened and finished on seventh. Of ten runners, the winner here was Zuka, who won that race by length in three quarters. Moving on to the third race of the day, the Dare to Dream Handicap for horses rated 61 to 86, rated 41 to 66 eligible to be run over a distance of 1100 meters. Couple of runners and race number 441, we had Hidden Gold. Hidden Gold had uh, placed earlier part of the season uh, practically in almost all starts. Last two starts has been unplaced, including this start where it took the turn in third spot, eventually finished on fifth. Dr. Doom was a winner of race number 66 since then has been on place in three starts including this one where it took the turn in fifth spot, made up a placing and eventually finished on fourth. The winner here was Clifford. Number 2 Eternal Princess. Eternal Princess after being off the board in first two starts. Last start definitely eye-catching starts for Eternal Princess. Race number 141 finished on second. Race number 158 after being in a forward position eventually finished on third. The winner here was Black Eagle got that race by a widening margin of six lengths. Number four is Archway. Back-to-back -back wins for Archway in race number 85, race number 98 respectively. Last start went over 1400 meters. This was in race number 117. It was in fourth spot as they entered the home straight when asked for an effort. was a little flat-footed then started to drop back and eventually finished on ninth of 11 none as the winner here was Royal Maiso. Number 6 is Kalahari Gold, started the season with a win in race number 6 where got the measure of star justice then placed in the next two starts in race number 66 finished on third to Dr. Doom last start. The one we are looking at is from race number 99, was on a start to finish mission as you can see with the claret jacket, the gold epaulets, eventually finished on third. The winner here was Hall of Grace who got that race by a long neck. Number 7 is all-time legend and uh, all-time legend after knocking on the doors for a few starts. Last start finally came good and what a win this was in race number 157. Went over 1400 meters, made every post a winning one, drifted off a straight line but eventually won that race by 6 and a quarter lengths, beating She's Our Star in second. Number 8. La Dominate, La Dominate after knocking on the doors in couple of starts, ran an unplaced race in race number 108, then in race number 125 got into a ding-dong battle for about 150 meters with divine thoughts eventually prevailed by a long neck. Today the mount of Vivek G is La Dominate. We move on to the fourth race of the year of the Adiella Handicap for us is rated 21 to 46, rated 1 to 26 eligible to be run over a distance of about 1400 meters. The first one I'll be looking at is Italian Gold. Italian Gold has had quite a few starts, has been knocking on the doors. The last start was in race number 140 where it was in seventh spot. Then came up with a big run but uh, could not catch the runaway leader. The RD just fell short by almost half a length. His Italian Gold again the mount of Abdul Fazal. Number 2 Liban. Liban was a winner in race number 90, the one we are looking at where practically the field were really on the wider outside and Liban uh, drove the outer rail and eventually got the race from Mars by almost three and a half lengths. Today again the mount of AIR's Khan. Couple of runners, number 3 Cosmic Cowboy, number 7 Ticker. Cosmic Cowboy winner in race number 61, went over 1200 meters, uh, beat Soul Music. Then uh, in race number 122, finished on 4th, last start, went on a start to finish mission but packed up and eventually finished on 10th. Ticker was a winner in race number 138 here. Ticker was a little slowly out of the gaze, took the turn in 12th spot, then made up some glade gains and finished on 7th.
we have a few runners which went up against each other. Pirgos, Pirgos, who was a winner in the first start of the season in race number 32, since then has had a couple of placed efforts over here. Pirgos ran in ninth spot throughout and stayed on in ninth. Number six, Blue Chip. Blue Chip uh, earlier two starts finished on second and third in race number 78 and race number 109, respectively, over here. Being on a start to finish mission, eventually finished on fourth. We had number 10, which is Dubai King, was a winner in race number 97 over here. Dubai King was in second spot, eventually weakened and finished on third. The winner here was Super Akiga. Number 5, Tenderheart. Tenderheart has, a, has had a decent season to win so far for Tenderheart in race number 25. Got the measure of ticker. Then uh, in race number 144, the one we are looking at was in second spot for through, throughout and eventually took charge into the last 150 meters and went away from them, won the race by 6 lengths, beating a wink and a smile into 2nd. Number 8 is Soul Music, Fear of the Magic Spell was winner in race number 41, where got the measure of sporting trainer. Then race number 61 finished on 2nd. Then couple of unplaced efforts, the run we are looking at is from race number 92, was in 5th spot throughout. Then started to slide back through the field and eventually finished on 6th. The winner here was Blinky Bill. Number 9, Speculator, after coming down from Western India, where a start Speculator had in race number 59, got the measure of the field by almost 3 lengths. Next start, the one we are looking at is race number 118, where it was in 3rd spot throughout, then eventually dropped back in the last 100 meters and finished on 4th, just out of the place money, the winner here was King's Retreat. Number 11 is Made in Heaven. Four starts for Made in Heaven after coming down from Madras. Three unplaced efforts. Last start was in uh, third spot throughout. Then uh, just missed the place money. Finished on fourth. The winner here was Hoping Sky who got that race almost by four lengths. Today, P.S. Chauhan again rides Made in Heaven. We move on to the 5th and feature race of the year after the Adjudicate Cup for horses 4 year old and over to be run over a distance of uh, 1600 meters. First 3 runners we are looking at is Siege Perilous, Tigrio and Saivi Chick. Siege Perilous winner of couple of starts in race number 113 and race number 135. Over here Siege Perilous was in 3rd spot then weekend and eventually finished on 4th. Tigrio started the season with back to back wins has been unplaced in the last 4 starts. Here finished on 5th after racing in 5th for most while. Savi Chick, the other runner who was in front as they entered the home straight, then weakened and eventually finished on 2nd to Itosha. Number 2 is Stockbridge. Stockbridge uh, has been knocking on the doors and uh, placed efforts in race number 51. Since then has been 5th uh, in race number 82, 4th in race number 100. And last start was in 2nd spot as they ended the home straight, then weakened a little bit and eventually finished on 4th. The winner here was Siege Perilous, another runner in this race. Number 4 is Harvest Time. Harvest Time has uh, graduated into the Terms Company for the first time. Couple of wins for Harvest Time in the season in race number 45 and race number 74 respectively. Last start, Harvest Time was giving a chunk of weight to the eventual winner Blinky Bill but chased the winner all through the home street and eventually finished on a length adrift to Blinky Bill. We move on to the 6th and last race of the day, the Native Night Cup for horses rated 41 to 66, rated 21 to 46 eligible to be run over a distance of about 2000 meters. The first one we are looking at is Ivanhoe. The first start for Ivanhoe on the Calcutta track after switching base from Hyderabad was in 2nd spot for most while then started to weaken and eventually finished on last. The winner here was Ono Mate Stable Mate which was Tommy Ocean who got that race by 4 and a quarter lengths. Number 2, Dubai Star, back-to-back -back win for Dubai Star, win legend out of Woodburg, won in race number 134 after being a little slowly out, was in 8th spot, then took charge into the last 100 meters, last start, similar story, was again a little slowly out, was in 3rd spot as they entered the home straight, then circled the field and won that race by 2.5 lengths, beating Steiger Shark in 2nd.
Number three is Mandela. Couple of stars for Mandela after coming back from Hyderabad. In race number 125, finished on 9th of 15 runners last start, was in 6th spot at the end of the home straight, came up down the centre and made up a placing and eventually finished on 5th. The winner here was Fortune Teller who got that race by almost 4 lengths. The last runner for the day is Dragon's Gold. Dragon's Gold has been knocking on the door so far in the season. Last two starts has been a little disappointing. Finished on fourth in race number in 16. Last start after being in a prominent position throughout and weakened and eventually finished on sixth of 12 runners. The winner here was Blackstone who got that race by four and a quarter lengths. So that's the runners and riders for the day ladies and gentlemen. Thank you and I'll see you at the races.